Hello everyone and welcome to episode 2 of our new Undertale series. We are going to take off where we left off after we just talked to Flowey after sparing Toriel. Here he comes. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. And it makes a farting sound. Hehehe, <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans, Sans the Skeleton. Why, hello, Sans. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Nice going, Papyrus. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. That is a very conveniently shaped lamp. Sup, bro. You know what's up, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. You want to do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit around boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. But I'm... Ch Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. But I'm... Ch Ugh! I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Nyehehehehehe. <laughs> Hey. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. The convenience of that lamp still, still fills you with determination. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Use the box? Yes, I will use the box. Hey, there's a tough glove in here. It's 
Snowdrake flutters forth. Clearly this isn't the way to go. I'm just going to flee. So, as I was saying about Undyne... Dramatic looking back and forth. Sans, oh my god, is that... A human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god. Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god. Sans, I finally did it. <laughs> Undyne will. I'm gonna, I'll be so popular. Popular, popular. Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. You know what? I think I'm just gonna flee. Like, I, I don't know how to do this. I normally just flee. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. You pet Doggo. What? I've been pet! Oh, he's going a little insane. Hey! Spare! S -s -s something pet me. Something that isn't m moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Someone's been smoking do dog treats. Hey, ya sans. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Thanks, Sans. Nice to be informed. Oh, oh, something attacked me. Lesser Dog appears. Oh, I love Lesser Dog. It's a snowman. You're so lazy. You are napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh ho, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will admi administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because... The amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. 
Okay, you could go ahead now. Zap, zap. Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Can I, like, go around awning? Oh, I didn't actually mean to. Like, get zapped. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sam. You will surely be conf confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man... Isn't my brother cool? He is very cool, Sans. <laughs> His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Oh, okay. Unsuspicious smell, smell puppy, blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell, humans, green rating. Destroy at all costs. Okay. I don't really want to be destroyed at all costs, so... Yeah. I don't, I don't know about that. Human, I hope you are ready for... Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Alright. It's a word search. Sans, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that easy-peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Yeah, well, you know, that's the one you left on the ground, Sans. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder, Jumble or Crossword? I'm gonna have to go with the Crossword. You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. <laughs> Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Ah, uh, great job. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap. Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly tr is, uh, japed again, or is that japed? I don't really know. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. Nyeh, <laughs> Papyrus. Save. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Save. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. Warning. Dog marriage. Oh man. Oh yes. Oh man. Ew. 
Eh, I'm just gonna flee. I'm out of here. Oh man. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. F hmm, here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Dogai assault you. All right. The dog's minds have been expanded. Oh, hey, I could spare them now. All right. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. What? How did you avoid my trap? And, more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? I left it. Really? Wowie, you resisted the flavor of my home-cooked pasta. Just so you could share it with me. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papy Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. Ha 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 Wait, no idea what do you have to say, Papyrus. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. All right, we shall proceed. Hello, Sands. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Yes, I see, Sands. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see, these tiles... Once I throw on this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange-scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Yes, yes I do. Of course. Great! Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready! Alrighty, getting ready! Beautiful.
truck confronts you. Diff Trot's problems have been taken away. Good spirit, you won! Oh, would you look at that, it's a tail and a head! And it's wagging its tail, it's so cute! Ruff, ruff! And it stands up! And it's wearing armor! It's the greater dog. Greater dog wants some TLC. I think we're supposed to ignore it. Greater dog inches closer. Oh, oh man. All right, it killed me. So what does TLC mean? Am I stupid? I think I'm stupid. Greater dog is contented. I can spare it. <laughs> it jumps out of the armor. Aw, that's so cute. Aw. That is quite adorable. Oh, man. Human. This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Oh, man. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Uh, I'm not so sure about this. Because I am about... To do it! Oh man. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! That, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standard standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct, no class at all. Away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nye. Huh? I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. I, I think I, I got it, Sans.
All right, everyone, I think I'm going to end the episode there because it's getting rather long and I do not want anyone to have to sit through even more of this, um, if you are choosing to sit through this whole thing anyways. Uh, so I'm going to end it there and we will see you next time. Bye!